Introducing the Rehitza Microwave Crisper. Lid Assembly. Make sure both silicone washers are on the bolt before assembling the lid. Place the lid handle on top and tighten the bottom screw. Do not over tighten the handle. If you are having trouble installing the handle, hold the bolt head with a wrench and tighten the lid down by hand. Reheating leftover pizza. Preheat the reheatsa pan without the lid in the microwave for 1 minute and 30 seconds. For microwaves that are 700 watts to 1100 watts, preheat the reheatsa pan for 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Using oven mitts, remove the reheatsa pan from the microwave and place a cold slice of pizza on the pan. Cover with the lid and place the reheatsa pan in the microwave and cook for 2 minutes. Remove from the microwave and enjoy your meal. If the cheese is not fully melted, you can microwave without the lid for an additional 30 seconds. Making a grilled cheese sandwich. Butter the outside of two pieces of bread and place cheese in between. After preheating the reheatsa pan without the lid in the microwave for two minutes, remove the reheatsa, place the grilled cheese sandwich onto the pan, cover, and microwave for one minute and 30 seconds. Make sure you use oven mitts. Remove the reheatsa pan from the microwave and flip the grilled cheese sandwich, cover, and place back in the microwave for 30 seconds. Remove from the microwave and enjoy your meal. If it is not fully crisp, microwave for an additional 30 seconds with the lid on. Making mozzarella sticks. After preheating the reheatsa pan for one minute and 30 seconds, remove from the microwave and place four to six frozen mozzarella sticks on the pan. Place the reheatsa pan back into the microwave without the lid and cook for 30 seconds. Place the lid back on the pan and cook for an additional 45 seconds. Flip the mozzarella sticks and cook for an additional 45 seconds. Remove from the microwave and enjoy your meal. Cleaning the reheatsa pan. Clean with a damp cloth or sponge and wipe with a dry towel. The reheatsa pan is not dishwasher safe. Never submerge under water. Do not allow water to enter the base of the reheatsa.